Welcome back to Mango Plays Ridgeside Village and we're on the island at the moment. I do believe um, we are attempting this six days for 500 fruit. Oof. Mm. I am not sure I'm going to manage it, but you know, we, we, we're experimenting right now. We'll see, basically. Let's um, harvest away what we do have um, and then throw this through the seed maker. 27. I mean, not too bad. The Mango and Tamara are all getting together for the flower dance. If you can find a partner, you might even want to participate in the dance yourself. There's a little clearing beyond the forest west of town where we hold the dance. Arrive between 9am and 2pm if you're interested. I absolutely will be. Um, hmm. Do I want to increase my fairy roses? Probably not right now. Ah, uh, what else can we get done over here? Hmm. Stuff to sell. Okay, um, I do have some seeds to plant. So uh, let's get this done. Not a massive amount of seeds to plant, to be brutally honest. But, you know, small amounts better than nothing, as they say. Right, okay. Two days, three days. I think for the moment, I will leave those there. Uh, who's calling? Hello? Hello? Oh, it's June. Hello. Hi, Mango. Sorry if this seems weird, but I've got to say that uh, this light really brings out your eyes. Oh, we did FaceTime. Okay, fair enough. Thank you very much. That was very polite of you. Very nice of you. All of that good stuff. There will be rain on the island tomorrow. That might be kind of exciting. We, we've got to see whether or not uh, Rosa and Juliet will see the mermaid. Hmm. Okay. There's also... Oh, no. There's the, the festival tomorrow. No. <laughs> okay. What should I get done today? We have more honey pots to make. The thing that I did realize is I haven't done my normal trick of crab pots. Where where be crab pots? Fishing. Wood and copper bars. It might be worth now that we have automate, getting crab pots done. I mean, how much copper do we have? I mean, there's quite a lot in here. Storage materials. A whole stack. Let's do this. All right, I need I need wood. So, um, let's go to the beach, apparently, because I've gone all this way. Hello? Emily, how are you doing? The spiritual journey is individual, but you can always find someone to accompany you on that path. Hey, sweet. Yes, I like it. Also, we want to continue with our friendships. Uh, Goat Herd. Uh, Dyer. Who else? Alecto. A whole bunch of people, realistically. Uh, let's go. Hello, Willie. How are you doing? Thank you for the lift. Uh, let's grab Noah. And we're going to carpet this place in crab pots. I mean, how... 25 wood. That's pretty darn good, right? 25 wood. So that's four per hundred wood. Yeah. This this will earn us some money because we don't need bait for crab pots. Yeah. Okay. Hello, Gina Mose. And the bear's here as well. Ooh. What's this? Ancient glowing huckleberry. I don't think I'm supposed to have this already. A massive juicy berry that faintly glows. Um. Hmm. I will pop it in my fruit and I won't sell it just yet because I think we need to actually meet the druid technically to get them. Um, so we'll wait until that happens. Oops. We'll leave Noah here. We'll call the tractor. Okay, let me grab some wood. Ah, there we go. How many did we get? Quite a fair amount. Let's go back to the beach. Actually, do I have a beach totem? I do. Okay. Right, let's start over here. Um, hmm. Okay. Uh, let's slob it here. Hmm. Where can I put my chest? Here? I 
guess so. Okay. Okay. Let's do that. And then we want to... Apparently I can make 56. It's going to be wood. Oh. I mean, 56 is a pretty good amount, right? Um, how do I do this? There we go. Uh, there seems to be a gap there. Is there a gap? No. Hmm. Will this connect? I don't know. Yes, what I can do is add bait to this chest and see if it gets loaded. Ooh, it didn't. Oh dear, okay. Hmm. Okay, let's uh, continue laying these. Okay, uh, let's try here. Oh, that worked. Did it grab? Did it load? It did. Fantastic. Okay. Um, let's uh, take one of those out for my storage. Okay. Oh, how very exciting. More money making opportunities. Okay. Uh, let's uh, throw this in here. Okay. It's 7.30 p.m. Let's see if I can find people. Um, Noah, I need you. So we want Electo. Uh, let's give them a call. Find out where they are. Uh, where are you? I'm up in the mountains near Robin's house. Ah, oh, lovely. Right, we'll head up there. And then... I'm trying to think of them al alphabetically. But honestly, I have no clue. Ooh. Um, is this still open? Good evening. Uh, let's grab you a prismatic shard. Because, you know... Is your favourite. Ah, oh, maybe I can be bribed with gifts after all. Indeed, I shall see you at the flower dance tomorrow. When I was younger, I used to be quite a nimble dancer. Ah, oh, but maybe one day I'll get the chance again. I am looking forward to seeing you dance with Marnie, man. And let's give Electo a gift. Oh, are you with the foxes up here? Hey, you've been poking your curious little nose into a Agora's business. Oh, we go way back. He has excellent taste in wine. You should bully him to giving you some. I'm sure he's hiding some excellent vintages in that lab of his. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, wine is a is a favourite of yours. Uh, by sure. Oh, thank you, darling. You're welcome, darling. Oh, look, we got our... Hang on, hang on a minute. Oh, okay. We need to adjust our automate. Uh, mod options. Automate. What flooring is that? I think it's gravel. Yep. Gravel path. There we go. So we're getting our um, maple. We'll also be able to do crab pots along here as well. Oh, getting wood income just automatically would be amazing. Right. Who else are we trying to befriend? I mean, everyone, obviously. But... I think Electo's the last one in this block. So, I wonder if there's another event for Electo. I hope so. I love Electo's events. Um, Sen as well. Okay. Lorenzo. We've got quite a few people up in Ridgeside. Let's, let's, go, let's go to Ridgeside. I'm loving the named minecarts, man. They're amazing. Hello. I was coming to see you. Doesn't Kiara understand that she needs to accept she can't change everything in this world? She needs to grow up. No. Honestly, yes, but no. It's one of the beautiful things about the youth is the... Everything can be amended, everything can be changed, everything can be made better. And that's such a beautifully hopeful, wonderful state of being. And whilst it's more realistic to be old and jaded and realise that not everything can be changed. Not everything can be changed all at once. Um, pick your battles, all of that type of stuff. Whilst it is probably better mentally so you don't feel failure as often as you do in your youth, 
it's also sad when people become old and jaded and realize that no we can't change the world and no unfortunately the world is a bit corrupt and some of the things we want to change can't be changed without everyone realizing that and I think we need both. We need the youth to have that hope, that desire. That is a way for change, and it needs to happen, in my opinion. So I don't agree she needs to grow up. Um, rabbit's foot, prismatic shard. It's my go-to. Can't wait until everyone's befriended and I can just sell it all. This is great, thank you. Because, you know, it gives me a lot of money. Kiara, do I need to... No, we're good with you. Okay. Um, so we just gifted Lorenzo. Oh, they've just dropped into eight hearts. June, we spoke to you today. Zane. Okay, let's see where Zane is. Uh, do, do, you'll be at the bottom of the list because alphabetical. Where are you? I'm at home right now. Okay. Fantastic. Let's go. Let's go to the Amethyst. Also should check what other quests I have. Um, I know I've got like a sewing one. I think we've got um, uh, a kill monsters one. I don't know what else we have. We'll check once um, I've said his hello to as many people as possible. It's getting a bit late, to be fair. Andrea, I should be able to give a gift to. Because even when they're sleeping, you can still gift them, which is amazing. Same, where are you? Do you need to do the charity uh, quest as well? We're saving up the milk. The eggs, the wool. Although the wool should happen once I get more rabbits, right? Hmm. Zane, seriously, where are you? Okay, I just have to accept I can't find Zane unless they're in this room, which I don't think is their room. Pretty sure this is painting for beginners by Tayo. Um, Irene's room. Okay, let's go. You guys sleep out here? Bless them. Okay, let's get a gold bar for the princess. Here you go, lovely. This is neat. Thank you. You're welcome. I like hiding around the museum. Makes me feel smart just standing there. Oh. Okay. Uh, let's. Yeah, let's go home. And then we are going to stay at Ginger Island. Oh, the snail. Professor Snail. I'll give them a gift tomorrow. I don't want to miss the flower dance, but I want to give uh, Juliet and Rosa enough time to get to the island with it being rainy. Because apparently I was just too quick, too keen. You're at one. Okay. Ah, we only need half a mil more. Oh. Universe are happy with their payment. Ah, I'm very glad. Right, let's, um, oh, yes, it's raining. Mm-hmm. Oh, no. Did I not plant those? Oh. Okay. Seeds. Uh, one there. Oh, we've got some to harvest. Now, what I will do is keep these for the moment. Because, yeah. Hopefully? we can collect enough and this is probably not 500 worth so maybe i should yeah plant some more i guess there we go um are you going to get watered no let's uh grab you Oop. does cause frame rate issues finding out the range of sprinklers oh dear we need more more i say Okay, let's get, like, three. Um, upgraded. Still not enough. You there. There we go, that's enough coverage. Alright, I will lob that one down as well. And I am going to go through... Oh! Look at my grabbers! Or my crab pots, should I say? We got eels this is amazing because we'll be able to like make sushi and all sorts of fish recipes okay we got a fair bit to get sold let's see how close we make it probably not massively close but i mean 
We're we getting there. 1.7. Oh, very nice. Okay, let's go uh, disturb this bird. Thank you. And um, I think I'm going to go through my storage, maybe. Have a look at what else I can think I can get away with selling. I think I can get away with selling that, for example. The stuff I'm sort of like making. Yeah. Probably. Okay, I've got a fair bit more to reclaim. Let's see how close we can get. Including four fox blooms. I'm gonna do it. Right? You even have a stack of void essence, which I think is insane. Yes! I, I am gonna sell the rest of this. We have a little bit of money left over. Well, I've got a very exciting purchase to make. Ah... Oh. Glorious. Okay, let's go make that purchase, then we can come back. Hello, Bella. Oh, yeah, did I say hello? Yes, I did. Pixie, you are right? Let me get you some water, guys. You also have a letter. Ooh. Give me go. Ciao. I thought I could send you a copy of one of my favourite dishes over to you. Have fun cooking, Lorenzo. Porridge? Souffle. Ooh, that actually... That sounds pretty cool. Oh, I've been... I've been waiting. How do you do? So the gun you helped send grow is beautiful. Aww. You're quite different than other humans. Thank you. The return scepter. Aww. Oh. Maybe. Oh. Hmm. I don't have the mod, mod, mod that I want installed in it. I will get that installed for the next episode. But yeah. Um. Oh, you have the return scepter. Ah. So now, I'm just saving for these guys. Actually, yeah, actually I think I'll wait uh, to install the mod until I have all of the totems. Because basically what it does is it, it acts like um, a minecart. So I can go to all of the warp locations, that mod. I can't remember what it's called. Um, so, yeah, I'll wait until we've got all of the, the totems. Because honestly... Uh, it probably makes more sense that it's only unlocked once you've got all the totems. Or maybe I've got it installed and that is the criteria. I don't know. I'll have to look. But for the moment, I'm just gonna, I'm just going to wait until sort of like... I don't know what time. Hmm. Do you give them until 11? What time do the villagers come over? Hmm. I don't see any villagers, but it might be because it's a festival day. I'm going to assume it's because it's a festival day. Oh... Have you ever visited the cave on the East Scarp Beach? That place looks scary. I swear I heard some voices coming from there the other day. Oh well, it was... it's... it was. It was probably the kids, right? Ah, probably a kid, yeah. I was actually going to your basement because I've heard rumour that you need me to appear in your basement. I feel like I've seen a, a cutscene with the basement with Rodney. What a mess. Are we going to tidy it up? Turn it into a really sweet gaming area, couldn't it? Oh, I'd love it. Hey, please come in. Thank you. I was. <laughs> you just walk over books? Yeah, this place is a dump. I didn't exactly plan to move in the valley in advance. When I brought this place, I emptied my house into a truck and here I was. Sounds pretty reasonable. Pretty much what most people do. So yeah, you really have a lot of useless junk. That's a lot. Do you need any help? That's really kind of you to ask, Mango, but no. I have devised the most ingenious solution to this hoarding problem. What's that? Ignore it? I'm going to set up a ledger upstairs so you can buy some of this stuff. It's a bit of everything, including some promotional material from my publisher. Ooh. Do you want... So you want to sell me your old stuff? Do you have money trouble, Rodney? No. I'll give all the money I make from this to Gunford to fund the library's educational programs. Oh, how very nice. I just spent all of my money. I'll set up the ledger very soon. Now, if you'll excuse me, I still have some work to do down here. Okay. You can leave now. <laughs> oh, dear. Where's the ledger? Down here? I can't see it. I don't see it. Oh wow, you got a bathroom? Christ, you got the best place in the whole joint. Where's the ledger then? This? 
You pick the moon. It is associated with illusion, fear, anxiety, subconscious, and intuition. That's Sebastian. Hmm. Oh, here it is. Oh, my world. Well, well oh, my word, even. Prunus Crown, an official replica of the crown worn by Arcana Catcher Prunus in a novel by author Rodney O'Brien. Uh, Rodney has the same exact hat, egg hat. Vincent made this hat. Can't you tell? Oh, my word. A cardboard cutout of Rodney wearing a winter star outfit. It can probably work as a scarecrow. Yeah. Oh, my word. Oh, I don't have enough money for this. Uh, summer outfit. Egg festival. Beach outfit. Right, there we go. I want the egg hat as well. Ah. Uh, my shop has wares if you have coin. <laughs> I think I'll put the scarecrows at Ginger Island. Uh, let's see. How's this look? Oh, I love it. Yes. Perfect. Alright, we've got a dance festival to get to. Yay! Hello, Ollie. How you doing? Nah, I'm not hiding. I'm the welcoming committee. Yeah, I volunteered for the job, if only to get out of the dancing. I don't blame you, lovely. Right, okay, we need to befriend Lorenzo. Presenting Anton and Paula want to dance with each other, but maybe they're too shy or caught up in their own head to say it. Nah, they've moved on from that. Oh my god, five all. They said you can only dance with a partner. Would you dance with me, Mango? I would. The air is sweet with the smell of flowers. Oh, Sen. I wonder if anyone would mind if I took a few bunches home. I wouldn't. Hello, Agura. How you doing? Yes, I came. Maddie indicated there would be food. There normally is. Oh my god, Rodney. Look at you in your suit. What a silly yet quaint event. Do you want to dance with me? You know that I'm kidding, right? Okay, fair enough. You don't want to get too close to a girl like me, Mango. No, really. I'll ruin your life. You'll see. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay. Uh, Rosa? The spring air is so fragrant. I should buy some flowers to brighten up the air. Aww. Um. Ooh, a rare crow. I probably already own it, to be fair, but I can't resist. Okay. I am going to be very specific about who I talk to. Just because, you know, I am. Ooh, Viv. Oh yes, it's lovely to watch young ones dance, but where's the dance for us geriatrix? We could show them a thing or two, I reckon. I agree. Who's that? I'm just enjoying the scenery. He. Oh wow! Look at this. This is so nice. Nobody's up here though. That's a shame. Okay. Hello, Mr. Ginger. Hmm. Do you think Marlon's ever going to ask her to dance? I've seen him face down terrifying monsters. What's he got to lose? His other eye. Indeed. Would it be too forward of me to ask Marnie for a dance? It would not. Please do it. No, to be young again and have someone to dance with. Oh, Mango, I can't possibly ask him. What if he says no? He won't. Ask. I'm more of a club person, honestly, but this is really cute. It is. Um, oh, we'll say hello to Jessie, because I love Jessie. Come to me if you ever need to talk, Mango. I'm no expert. I'm good at listening. Oh. Oh, hello there. It's nice of you to talk to me. Spring is almost over. What a shame. Oh, yeah, it is, isn't it? That I didn't even think of. Right, who else do I need to befriend? Oh, there's Dyer down here. Hey there, cutie. You look like you'd be good on the dance floor. I'll be keeping an eye on you. Oh, that also reminds me. You guys did let me know I should take people to the movies. So I will hopefully be doing that soon. Oh, there's our kids. Hello. I'm really not sure why I came to this thing. I'm no good at dancing. But I suppose it's a nice enough day and the company is a nice break from it all. Just don't expect to see me on the dance floor. Okay, fair enough. Oh, I know I need to befriend you a bit more, Bianca. I'm loving these dresses. Uh, never mind. Uh, Raphael, the flowers look majestic. It seems certain this emits some kind of floral magic. Hmm. Okay. Ah, why are you not with Matteo? Folk oh, dancing, how are you rustic? This bears little semblance to the dances I attended in Grampleton. Now those were sophisticated affairs. Mmm, I'm sure. Ask someone to dance. Oh, I couldn't possibly. 
a celebration of love and fertility. I hope I'm not expected to dance. People might laugh. Although I suppose I could always do the unhip hop. Oh, Jasper. I want to dance with you. Okay. Um, let's say hello to Eloise as well. I found Mango. You should ask my dad to dance. He never dances with anyone but me. I think he misses mum too much. Oh, Eloise. Don't break my heart, girl. Okay. I'm pretty sure... There's no one else to talk to that I need to befriend. Like, everyone else isn't here, basically. The goat, goat herd's not here. Um, Zane doesn't appear to be here. So, let's go ask Sterling to dance. When I was growing up, this was actually called the corn dance. The girls wore jewelry made out of corn kernels and danced around a specially grown giant corn crop while singing ritualistic chants. I can see why they'd change it. Just pulling your leg, Farber. Yes, dear. Ask Sterling to be a dance partner. Of course I'll dance with you. Yay! Hello, kids. Right. I love the fact that they're wearing their chicken mask. Um. Mayor, I'm ready. Yes, I start the dance. Oh. Anyone? No, it's just all the original bachelorettes. I hope... I hope that we'll get to see different people dancing in, in future... Uh, in, in an updated version of Stardew, put it that way. That will be very exciting. Remixed um, events, I think, would be cool. Because a lot of the time, I do come um, to pretty much every year's festivals and whatnot. But a lot of the time, I'm like, the, 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 everything's very the same. That was fun. Time to go home. Okay, let's uh, <laughs> drop off our... Scarecrows. Uh, did I have this one? I did. Bats. Okay. All right, it's ten past ten. We're still working on Key's crop. Uh, five days. Hmm. Not sure. We, we will. Oh, yes. We got. We got. Got a spare one. Um. Oh, did I? Hmm. I don't think I did. Go and give a gift and say hello to the professor. Let's do that now. I think I was, like, too excited about them meeting the mermaid. Like, I really want them to see the mermaid. This is a eight. Walk, walk. Oh, there you are. What I wouldn't do for a nice cup of tea and maybe some cookies. Oh, what I wouldn't do for you to maybe change what you said. You say that to me every time. And, and... I mean, it's great that you give me gift ideas. Like, I'm not against that, but... Give me more info. How remarkable. This is a wonderful gift. Hmm. I'm curious. Is there events? No, there's no events with Professor Snail. Ah. That's a real shame. Hopefully one day. Okay, time for bed. I do need to decorate this place as well, don't I? Yeah, not many days until summer ooh, which will give us a new quest to hopefully unlock uh i forget who this person we don't know the name yet uh ooh, all of this is ready to harvest and four days so if we replant maybe goodness will happen i don't know if i'm gonna get enough to be really honest, but that will have to wait for a future episode. Um, if you did enjoy, please do leave me a like. It really does help out the channel. Leave me a comment down below, down below even. Let me know what you'd like to see in a future episode. Just so you're aware, I am contemplating of changing up the episodes a little bit. Because uh, we're so close towards the end. A lot of days are not going to have any events in. So if we have a look... Okay, this is a bad... A bad example because apparently there's a bunch of events that didn't exist yesterday um but quite quite often the events won't exist so as we sort of like progress with all of our friendships the events will just not happen anymore um so i am contemplating doing uh, more days in a an episode and sort of like uh smooshing it together and, and just keeping it to sort of like the events uh, big sales, uh, big purchases even, um, like maybe showing you once I get the honeys all set up, the beehives, etc. 
and getting uh, prepared for the perfection uh, because yeah i want to keep the episodes interesting and you guys have seen me plant and pick and whatnot uh, in this series lots and lots already so i'm thinking we've cut that out let me know what you guys think of that down in those comments anyway that's enough of me rabbiting on if you did enjoy please do leave me a like i've asked you to do that well i've done it twice now what i will say is thank you so much for watching liking commenting subscribing all of that amazing stuff you guys do and of course a huge and very special thank you to my wonderful patreons whose names are scrolling across the screen as i speak and i will see you in the next one bye for now <laughs>